Okay, the next theme that I am going to play with is called Zarif Light. Now, something that you may have noticed, or uh, maybe not, is a lot of these themes that are free will have a professional or upgrade version. I encourage you to find a theme that you're comfortable using and that you don't necessarily need to buy any kind of upgrades to go along with. There are plenty of plugins out there and there are plenty of additional features out there that you can certainly add on to any of your themes. So I'm not sure that anybody really needs to go out and buy additional plugins, certainly not at this stage. I've gone ahead and added this theme in here. Now what's unique about this particular theme is that it truly is one of the full one page front end themes that we're seeing so much of today. I went ahead and applied it and it does not look like much here, but that's because it's still set to be on a static front page. If I come over here and customize this and flip it over to a posts page, then what takes over is the actual theme. Let me pop down here and do this. Let's save and publish that. And then I'm just going to back out of that because I need to, I, I'll need to stay there. So I'm going to go ahead and reload this. Now we can really see the true features of this particular theme. It typically in these types of themes features a large splash image up front here and um, if you take a look at this notice here's uh, features down here it is all one page and so as you scroll through each of these pages or as you click on each of these elements what you'll see is that it's all just one giant page scrolling down here the other thing that is unique to this particular theme and also very popular right now are parallax effects and what that means is that they've just got a bunch of extra fancy graphic types of controls in here and so that as each block loads it looks slightly different and has a little bit of different functionality so that's kind of fun to play with let me just go ahead and show you in this particular theme if I back out of here and this is very typical of this type of one page theme if I go to um, customize notice that it has changed my customize menu that's sitting over here on the left hand side in many of the other themes we didn't see nearly this many options the ones that you have always seen before static front page widgets menus etc those are always there but now this time instead of building out separate individual pages to drive this front end you would go through the different theme options here and you could for example under the big title notice that this theme here is one of the uh, top 10 this is where you would drive or would be driven the content and you could change the label of the button you could change the location where it links to etc I'm going to go ahead and just save and publish that and so if I reload this page and come up to the top now we can see that this is sitting in up here so these types of themes oftentimes will have a variety of different um, pieces in them that you have to kind of poke around in terms of finding out what they can do and take a look now I've just invoked what's called the parallax effect here if I reload that what the parallax effect is famous for doing is it kind of gives a 3D image. It may be a little hard to see on this video, but if you take a look, it's almost as if the background is moving separate from the front end image. So you can see that there's a picture of Lady Liberty here, but the back end image is moving, so it gives that parallel or parallax type of effect that is very, very popular today. There are other things you can explore in this particular piece. Um, 
Again, I don't really think that you need to upgrade in terms of, of costs, um, but you know you can and you can get additional effects such as vid uh, video background. Um, there's also a plugin that you can do that for for free. You would just come in here and um, go ahead and change each and every one of these little elements to customize it to your page. And everything you can do in this particular theme is customizable where you see, um, for example, the About section here. You would just come over here and find the About Us section. If you click on this, you can click on the element. You can even hide um, that particular chunk if you felt you didn't need it. Um, here are Here is the main content area. That's what's driving this center section here. Here's the big left side title, which is what this is here. The subtitle, which is obviously up in here. So this is yet another theme that is a lot of fun to play with. This one has some very, very popular features today, such as a single front end page, um, has parallax. And of course, you know, throughout all of this, you don't necessarily need to change massive amounts of your website design. You can still use a theme like this that is the one page front end. The only difference is that you would have a post or an element that would actually link out to your content pages should you decide to do that. So once again, those are some reviews of how to add some themes. Find a theme that you enjoy playing with, stick to it, and have a lot of fun.